it, guys. I'm gonna take the honor, sir. Do you want it? Good morning! Here we are on project number 12. This is our job site. Check it out. You hear machines running in the background, but you don't hear that sound of running water. We're in a beautiful neighborhood here in Rosemount, Minnesota. We actually have some clients in the area. It's so fun coming into an area where you already know where you are. Um, I love it. We're going to do our mini waterfall. That means it's about a three to five foot in length waterfall with only about a 12 inch buildup. This is family friends, so we get to start playing a little bit more. Uh, we brought our machines in. Typically on our mini, we don't use our machines, but things worked out really well. So we have our machines here. We got a full trailer of rock, gravel, different sizes. Justin's on his way with the stuff from the pond company. Thank you, Lisa. She is keeping us on point, and uh, we have a really good working relationship with the pond company. Absolutely love their service and we send people to her all the time we're mainly a, an installer people call us all the time asking about repairs about um, maintenance problems or even purchasing products from us unfortunately we do not sell products and we don't take on much for repair work as uh, our main thing is complete tear outs and full redos or starting from scratch where we get to do today I'm pumped whenever we have a family friend or someone that's connected to our lives deciding that they want to invest in what it is that we love so much what I love so much uh, my career I get really excited I want to make sure that that water feature is exactly what they want and then some so today we're gonna to play with some big boulders on our mini and we're gonna have a huge impact the liner is about a 10 by 10 liner for our stream so that's what's going to be our limitation that's kind of what says this is as big as it can get it is our mini that means it has a 2,000 gallon an hour pump we're going to have a couple of underwater lights and uh, we're going to have some fun with it so stay tuned because project number 12 gets started right now As a courtesy, the client said, well, you know, if you get rid of that gravel, we wouldn't be too sad. So we did what we could. We got rid of a good two and a half tons of soil, gravel mixture there. When we do that, we pull all of the fabric aside. We pull all the plastics aside. Anything that can't go through the pulverizer or get reused, we get out of there. Now we get to have fun. Dig our basin in and start building our waterfall. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> It's our mini comes with two small aqua blocks and our pump housing and then we have extra water storage because we get a little bigger liner and we have that extra gravel in there so boom extra liner top off line 2,000 gallon an hour aquascape pump there's your float if you ever wonder what it looks like it works like the back of your toilet so when your water level goes low it asks for water, and it goes up, and it closes it. So basin's in before lunch, and then we'll start building that waterfall. Awesome. So we got busy. Thankfully we had the hyper laps running, but guys went to break and I got hit with inspiration and uh, Justin and I did a lot of the big outcroppings and then the guys came back from lunch and just hopped right into it. Fantastic, it was so nice. Brad got to doing one of the more technical things, putting on the diffuser. This is our mini spillway. It's only uh, 12 inches. Perfect for our mini, uh, our mini pondless waterfall. We're gonna have 2,000 gallons an hour coming over these rocks. We got a lot of, lot of detail work ahead of us we're gonna have three lights on it 
So we'll be lighting up that area, lighting up down here. And uh, we're just gonna keep plugging away. Things are looking great. Plumbing is in, so we did it the way that, you know, the 20 steps, we got that plumbing down, buried it at the same time as we were burying everything else. Thank you, Mr. Whitstock. That right there is how you know that your pondless waterfall is full. You'll see water at the base in there. And uh, now, since it's full, I think we're gonna go ahead and plug it in. I think I'm gonna take the honors today. Let's, let's do this. Ooh, I like it. Yeah. Now we tweak it and play with it a little bit and get it how we want it to look. All right, so we plugged it in and then we thought, ah, we better foam a certain few areas here just so the water goes over a couple of rocks. That's the main thing with waterfall foam is to get the water to go over the rocks we want it to go over instead of sneaking behind. So uh, we'll get a couple of spots foamed up. Otherwise, there's no leaks. The water's staying inside our liner. That's our biggest concern. And then our next biggest concern is making sure that we get the look we're trying to achieve. But man, there was a huge sound difference between that turning on and not being running. So I can't wait to have it running and the client's gonna come home to seeing it running tonight. How cool. putting down our mulch. We like this western red. It looks a little red at first, but after about three weeks of being in the sun, it turns into a nice brown. And then it doesn't break down as fast as other mulches, so it's a good high quality mulch. Keeps the bugs away, helps uh, insects from not taking over your plants, keeps the moisture on the plants so they grow nice and lush. And then it degrades and turns into black dirt. So we're real big fans of that mulch. Waterfall's looking good. The guys are just doing detail work right now. All right, Aiden's top dressing. So we're just hitting up a bunch of little extra spots for the clients here because we have the means to do it for them a little easier than a lot of people can do it for themselves. Thank you, Aiden. This was a one day waterfall and man, it turned out spectacular. Our mini is anything but mini. I think they're gonna be sitting around enjoying it for some time. Do you wanna be on camera? Sure. <laughs> oh, and so happy he's writing a check to the man right now. <laughs> Check this out.
sponsored by pond king water gardens. living works of art, one yard at a time.